Good morning. Good morning. Should we go to Chicago? Yes! It's our first time really seeing and staying in Chicago. I'm from the Midwest, so it sort of feels like going home to me in a way. I know so many people who love Chicago, so I'm excited to see it. We made it. We made it to Chicago. Home of the bears. Home of the bears and the bulls. Did I get that right? Yeah, the bears and the bulls. Oh my god, I didn't know. <laughs> this, this is my first time in Chicago, I think, ever. Okay, no, I did come here when I was three years old, but I don't remember anything. Got off the train, I walked around with my mom, and then I got back on the train, and that was it. We're newbies. Pizza and hot dogs. That's what we need to try. That's about all I got. They have like one of the biggest, tallest, most ornate Starbucks roasteries, I think. <gasps> it's like four stories. I don't think any of them are bigger than that. So, so. we're gonna go check that out. Yes, obviously and then that's our first stop. We're also meeting up with a couple people, like the only people that we know in Chicago, Tyler and Paul. Well, it's Paul. such a small city. Such a small town, don't know anybody Maybe here. we need more friends. But we know a couple gays, so we are meeting up with them at the Starbucks Roastery, and then we're going to see touristy things in Chicago and find some pizza and hot dogs. Yeah. This is a Chicago trolley. So ready cute. to stand in line? Yeah, I'm so hungry. We haven't like eaten anything all day. We got sample. It's iced. There's an ice cube in it, so Ooh. don't choke. Oh, this is so exciting. This hall said it's one of the few, the few <laughs> curb escalators in the world. This is sweet. Yeah. We did it. We did it. We did it. We got the hazelnut. You have no idea what you got. I have no idea she what was I got. Like, this is my favorite, and it's iced. And it was none of the things that he said. He was like, Do you like this, this, or this? She just said something else. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> Your eggs. So. Hey, the, the, bread. the bread looks I don't know if it's going to be hot. Is the bread it? is. It's really hot. The oh oh my god. god! The bread is in a heart. <laughs> the bread is in a heart. You have to turn oh, the camera on. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> it's too hot. <laughs> the bread has balls. <laughs> Mine's just lobster. <laughs> Those are eggs, actually. <laughs> is it? They're is eggs. that what it is? I don't know what it is. They're literal eggs. eggs. The eggs <laughs> cannot be balls. We got some, some bread and huevos. We had an evening to explore, and thank goodness that Tyler is a professional pointer so that we didn't miss any of the buildings. Are you done looking at comments on your video? You know, they hate me. Everyone hates me and it's okay. After pointing at all the buildings, he said we should check out the Riverwalk and then did this. Sorry guys, I just gotta take off my shirt. Oh, oh. <laughs> Find him on OnlyFans. Then we went somewhere pretty sweet. London House Hotel has a rooftop bar and some of the best views of the Chicago skyline and river. Cheers. Cheers! After a drink on the roof, we walked towards Millennium Park, which had this huge public concert going on, full of people watching. It was such a pretty night and just like the best ambiance. I'm pretty sure he's gonna play WAP next. Do you want me to go up and play a song? This please. And please play Chopsticks? Please play the piano. <laughs> As we went further into the park, we came across maybe what is the most disturbing piece of art I've ever seen in my life. We found a fountain! Who is she? They're, they're I want her to spit people. on me. They got a bunch of like random people yeah. to film it. They had like a thousand yeah. images or something crazy. Just from a dental office? There was like a dental office involved. Does that what? inspire you, Michael? No. This could be you spitting on strangers. Uh, <laughs> this could be your office. Wait, who's spitting on? Your patients. So they water will come out. Oh no. Yeah, no, I'm, yeah. I'm not kidding. Yeah. Literally water comes out the mouth. Is this art? <laughs> Isn't it hot? No. <laughs> <laughs> nope, it just, it happens. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> the child, there we go. No. <laughs> Why does it do that? Why is it like that? Everything is so wrong. 
Welcome to Chicago. After all that, we headed to Cindy's rooftop to enjoy some dinner and drinks and then headed out to Boys Town. Almost immediately, Tyler was being chaotic. Mike. <laughs> and they're all in their, their dark skin. <laughs> you know what? They're just ignoring me. Good morning. Good morning. I got you breakfast in bed. Oh my gosh, what did you do? Like, all this food. <laughs> it's a lot of food. We've woken up. I've gotten breakfast. There's bacon, sausage, French toast, pancakes, and then like double it all. And then we have a wedding today, so that'll be most of the day. But we're gonna be out on a yacht later, which I'm super excited about. What'd you get? We got a Luminati's pizza. Illuminati. Yeah, apparently the original. Giordano's online says is like a close second. So, this is a personal pizza. $15 and we each get half. It doesn't look like, you know, it doesn't photograph well, I don't think, but we'll see how it takes. Hold this. <laughs> Reviews. We got the Express. I don't think this is the true representation. I mean, it's fine. It's nothing to write home about. I think if you got it in the restaurant, maybe we messed up. After the wedding ceremony and the Chicago pizza fail, it was time for the wedding reception out on the yacht. It was a tad windy, but this was legit such a cool concept. And to top it all off, we got a firework show at the end of the night. Good morning again. Morning. We had a great time at the wedding last night. I'm still bad at waking up. He's still waking up. Next up is brunch in Boys Town with our friends a Adam and T. I, I think it's a drag brunch. <gasps> oh, you're right. I forgot it was a drag brunch. We need some cash. We need some caffeine. Okay, drag brunch. <laughs> After brunch, it was time to get to our architecture tour. This is something multiple people recommended, so it seemed like the most obvious next item on the list. But first, a little snack on the river walk. Are you happy? If there was ever an aesthetic that was my personality, it would be this. French fries. Beer. Pretty river. Sun. And reggaeton playing in the background. You can't get any better than this. We could take this man anywhere, but this is what he wants to do 24-7. Literally, I'm so happy I can stay here for the rest of the day and be perfectly satisfied. Just like keep the fries coming. After dinner, we ended up back at Adam and T's house. We were actually able to walk there from our dinner spot. Um, we didn't really film anything there. We were just catching up. They had just gone through surrogacy a couple years ago. We we're going through it now. I just was enjoying the conversation and just didn't pull any of my cameras out. Approximately 10 hours later. Our last day in Chicago, we had a few hours to burn in the morning, so we headed to brunch. Matthew found this like uber Instagrammable cafe that was pretty, but oh my God, so overpriced. <laughs> Not saying don't go, but like better for pictures than food, I would say. Then here's Matthew really annoyed with me because I wanted to walk around Maggie Daly Park. I thought it looked cute on the map and I was right. Once he found out I was right, he was happy. Ready to go? <sighs> no. And that was it. That was our whirlwind Chicago weekend. It was great. We got like a lot of travel ahead today. We have a lot of travel. In Train, general. planes, Ubers. Automobiles. Let's go. Come on. Ready. Come on, I'm not ready. Let's go. And that concludes our Chicago trip. It is not the last time we will be there because we definitely need to actually try legit deep dish pizza in Chicago instead of like express failed microwave pizza.